morning, Bob. Good morning. As we head into April, uh, there'll be some changes at the county level. First, I want to touch on the April 5th election, uh, Tuesday, April 5th. Polls in Dodge County and statewide are open from 7 a.m. until 8 p.m. And uh, locally, all county board supervisors are up for re-election, all of the districts and that statewide. Uh, each term is for two years. Um, here in Dodge County, we have seven board members who chose not to run for this new term. And I just want to thank them and identify them. We'll start with uh, County Board Chair Russell Cocky. He'll be stepping down. Um, second, Vice, second Vice Chair Joe Marsick. Uh, supervisors Alan Bale, Jeff Barris, Tim Kimmel, Tom Nickel and Travis Schultz will not be returning to the board. Of our 33 county board seats, we have 12 contested races, which is uh, more than normal. Um, looking at statewide, I read just the other day that in Dane County, which has a larger board than Dodge County, they're expecting one third of their board to turn over. And that's fairly typical uh, based on age and sometimes people, you know, after serving a number of terms decide to step down and to um, let somebody else uh, tackle the challenges and so it's it's an opportunity and we certainly want to thank all of those who have served at the on the county board and all of them we certainly welcome the new ones to the county board and the April County Board meeting will be Tuesday the 15th and that is a 9 a.m. meeting and one of the first order of businesses will be to elect a new county board chair, a vice chair, and second vice chair, and also elect members of the executive committee. So that'll be the first couple items on the agenda on the 19th, and again that's 9 a.m., 4th floor.